What makes a place a home? How do we make where we live, where we live? Show us your photo wall. Show us your art. Show us you. This video series is about how we make our spaces unique to us. This is Room to Room. Exciting. Eclectic. And homey. And there's a lot going on, but I think that it um, it reflects a lot of who I am. There is a lot of green. Green is my second favorite color um, after yellow, but green is a very calming color. Ah, green really reminds me a lot of nature. And, uh, it's really bright and lifelike. I like feeling like my dorm is alive. Um, my mom is a super avid gardener. Um, and we have a lot of houseplants at home and in my bedroom at home I have a ton, way more than here. Um, and I just like being able to take care of something. Besides, <laughs> I have a lot of stuffed animals. Um, they all have names. This is Humphrey. Um, he's weighted and it feels like you're holding... It's really comforting having a weighted stuffed animal. It feels like you're holding something that's a little bit alive. I have lots of frogs. Uh, this one's Fred. And then there's Fred Jr. Uh, I have a couple hanging from the ceiling. And I have um, frogs and mushrooms because there's just a lot of those there and I really like them. I don't know really why, like, but they're very cute and quirky. Um, I really like making things out of clay uh, because I like, I have a lot of like touch thing issues. So when I will be in a lecture or on a Zoom class or just watching TV, I can just make stuff out of clay and kind of passively think about it. I've done arts and crafts for as long as I can remember because my mom has always had a very artsy, craft-like home. Um, and I like to host art night in my dorms where we just like hang out, we'll do art together, eat snacks, talk, and it's a lot of fun. And it's just really nice because it's never any barriers to entry and you just have the creative freedom to make whatever. And it was one of the things that helped to make friends pretty early on was bonding over like creativeness and our shared love for artwork.